Saturday, you can head down to 4th Street Live for a night filled with food trucks, retail vendors, and performances, and so much more. It's during the Asian Night Market. The event's going to highlight entrepreneurs and small business owners that are right here in our community who are of Asian heritage. Joining us now with more on what you can expect is Amber Ma, Minoru Chow, and Han Young. Great to have you all here Thank again you. today. Thank you so much. Thank you know, you. Amber, it's great to have you back again, oh, telling us about the great work that you guys do in the community, right? This is so great to have a world, we're, this is a world-class market that's it coming to 4th Street Live. And I know you're, you're excited to kind of bring this taste of Asian culture to people. What can we expect? I am so excited to announce that we're going to have our second annual Asian Night Market at 4th Street Live again uh, this Saturday. Uh, we're going to have over 10 uh, different food trucks uh, from Chinese food, Thai, Vietnamese food, Indian food, there's sushi, uh, there's also Filipino vendors, and also we have over 10 local performance groups, mm -hmm. and we also have over 20 vendors, uh, including both food and retail, so we're just very excited for people to come out to Forestry Live this Saturday and spend the night with us. It's beautiful weather and lately, it's too. Free. It's free to attend, right. you know, and all you're paying for is is, is your food there uh, but a great it's very family friendly it is family yeah. friendly we actually will have an uh, family friendly activities uh, upstairs mm -hmm. at Forestry Live this year we have additional seating up there too so this event will be very spread out and come and have fun with us it you met your friends you met your family the event is from 5 to 10 o'clock so 5 to 7 we'll have a met more family friendly type of performances and at 7 o'clock is when everybody's gonna be there we're just gonna have a great time uh, very excited for have yes. to have you guys well, yeah. Lenore, talk a little bit about like how this elevates local business so it, yeah it gives them an outlet to kind of show off all the great things that they have of course um, so we're celebrating the mid-autumn festival it is an auspicious day in a lot of Asian it's countries the great importance on this yes. weekend why so, you're having it now yeah um, I know mainly China celebrates it as one of the biggest celebrations in the country mm -hmm. but countries like Korea um, Japan, Vietnam, um, Philippines, a lot of Asian countries, East Asian, Southeast Asian, celebrate this holiday. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, Han, you're with District 6, one of my favorite places in St. Oh. Matthews, by the way. It's really good. Thank you brought a you. sample. You're going to be there. Yes. Uh, set up one of the vendors there. Talk about what you have. And, um, you know, we want people, too, to get a sample and then go to these restaurants, right? right? Yeah. And, and, and support our community. Tell us what you have here. We're going to have a variety of dishes down at uh, 4th Street Live, but I bought these two, our customer favorite. Mm -hmm. These are in our family restaurant for generation. These are Mama Minis. My mom make them every holiday, every meeting, every gathering in the District 6 Wonton also. The District 6 Wonton is <laughs> like heaven <laughs> wrapped uh, up in there. Thank um, you. you for, the, for the dishes you said your mother would make every holiday, what yes. is in that? In there have pork and shrimp mm. and then noodle. My mom would make it. Or when my sister in school, she traveled back, my mom would make them in let her care with her back home. Mm -hmm. I mean, back to the school. Yes. So, and then I need to know the secret of what's in The District 6 wonton <laughs> have six wonton. pork and shrimp also. It has bok choy, ginger, and onion. Mm -hmm. And it's in a homemade um, chili sauce we made in-house. Mm -hmm. Everything is homemade in-house, and it's family recipe. So Why want, is it important for you to be a, a part of this second annual event? Because I want to share our heritage, and I want to share our family uh, recipe so everyone can know and everyone can make it. Mm -hmm. So if, if they ask, I will share them my recipe and they can make it. Absolutely. You know, and you guys, uh, Amber, do such a great job at the Crane House of, it is an event and it is fun, but there is a message and a meaning that this is a way to open doors and share from one community to another, right? Like I feel like if right. we go, you go enjoy something like this, you understand more about people and I think you appreciate and value people more in culture. Exactly, and also, you know, the Asian night market, we want to bring people from all ethnicities to come to the Asian night market. You know, people that are American, people that are Asian American, people that are African American, people from different communities to come and celebrate the Asian night market. Like Manuru said, this is a celebration of the Harvest Festival, yeah. the Mid-Autumn Festival. But besides that, we, uh, a crane house, we want to be bring a little bit of Asia to Louisville, to the greater Louisville, for people to have a chance to taste a little bit of Asia from different yeah. local restaurants uh, going from vendors to food trucks to live performances all of our vendors are local yeah. uh, you know 
everybody here is a proud Louisvillian that's going to be coming right. to the Asian night market. And not, and not just celebrating the food of East Asia, we should say, right? Yes. Like you're opening up the doors, letting everybody yes. realize there's a, there's a lot to Asia. The foods that are there are representative of all of Asia. Exactly. Yes, that's that's correct, Claudia. Right. Guys, great to see you all. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Hope to see you, Thank you so much. to see you all down there. All right. So again, this event is happening uh, this Saturday from 5 to 10 p.m. at 4th Street Live. The event is free. You're just paying for your food there. Come down, enjoy the live entertainment. They're going to have some family friendly events as well, but uh, just going to be a beautiful night all around to get down there. Well, coming up, stay with us.